Okay, so that this plugin we're looking at now is called Woo Sidebars. Okay, so what you can do is you can add it through the the plugins thing if you download it from uh, from uh, Woo, or you can um, uh, add it to your um, add it through your FTP. So what we'll do is we'll um, activate it. Okay, so the the plugin's now activated, and you'll see that. Um, under under um, your, your sidebars area, widget areas, okay? So what this allows you to do is to create a widget area, for instance, if you've got like a company profile, uh, a page that you've created and you've got sub pages, you can create a widget area for those pages. So what we'll do is we'll show you how you can do that. So we'll call this, this widget area company, uh, we'll actually we'll call it services. Okay, and then what I do is I select the the um, the, the the page, and you, you can do it by page, post type, taxonomy, terms, uh, or hierarchy. But I'll, I'll these three pages because services uh, editing and writing is under services. So I'm going to basically create a sidebar, and you can put a description in there if you want. It's not necessary. And then you select what sidebar you want to replace. Okay, so I'm going to replace the primary sidebar here. And I'm going to publish that. So what I've done is I've created a new widget area. And so when I go to widgets, you'll see that I've got a widget area for that. So I'm going to put our team in there and testimonials, uh, two, two widgets in there. And you see when I go to the website, you'll see here, uh, I've removed those. But when I click on our services, okay, you'll see the, the, the widget, I've created a widget and with special widgets in that area. So you can put like under your contact page, you can have a map in the sidebar and your contact details in the sidebar and just the form in the main body area. And that's a real bonus and, it, and it's a great little plugin and it works with any WordPress theme and should be, should, you should have no, no problems. So again, once you install the plugin, you'll be created in this widget area. And then the important thing is that when you create uh, a widget area, you make sure that you your you're replacing the, the correct sidebar and you're selecting the right pages. And you can create multiple. You could end up having 20, you can have a sidebar for every single different page if you wanted to. And you can have create sidebars for your, for your post types, um, each individual post, blah, blah, blah. So there's, a, there's, there's no limits on what you can do and it's fairly well documented. Uh, so uh, if, you, if you need any help, help with that, you basically go to the... Uh, the Woo sidebars thing, and it's got um, uh, it, 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 it's got all the things you everything you need to learn about uh, Woo sidebars with a nice little video. So that's the Woo sidebars plugin by uh, by Woo Themes.